All this time we were playing Red Dead Online Ron, but now, for the first time ever, you will see how to play this game the way Rockstar wanted us to. I mean, if you will take a look at the biggest Red Dead Online updates, you will see that Rockstar were adding different activities that punish you for being rude and violent, for killing even the smallest squirrel. And it makes sense, I mean, Wild West was definitely not a place for toxic behavior. Who wants to rob banks or trains when you can't put animals to sleep or pick flowers. Anyway, I will create a new character and try to level it up with no kills at all. Not a single NPC, animal or other player will be killed. In fact, I'm not gonna be shooting at all. So creating a new character, making sure that she's young enough to date Leonardo DiCaprio, watching trailer that shows all these things we're not gonna be doing, like robbing trains. Oh, actually Rockstar immediately shows us what to do, like be kind, go fishing, die from Grifers, make photos. Anyway, here in the player starts, we see the most important parameter for Red Dead Online total kills, and it should be zero forever. Since I skipped the tutorial, let's go and get a free horse. Okay, I'm immediately stuck and I guess it's because Rockstar don't want you to go anywhere and shoot anybody. On the second attempt, enter in stables and mount it. It works fine now, so get in a horse and we're ready to grind. Actually, if you're a high level, earning money and experience without kills is extremely easy, just go grind naturally to your collector role. But as a beginner, I don't have gold to purchase these roles, so I started to cry but then remembered I I can pick myself flowers sorry for that I promise you no more terrible singing anyway I was collecting flowers for like 20 minutes around Valentine not only flowers but herbs mushrooms and stuff like that and now let's go and sell all this stuff to see how much money I've made and yeah in case you don't know you can sell herbs to doctor in Valentine 25 cents per each herb it ain't much but it's an honest work anyway I've made like 17 dollars and well well, it will take forever to earn any sort of money this way, so I will have to change my grinding method. Oh, hi stranger, I'm just a friendly person in Valentine. So my new plan is grind enough gold and buy a roll, and daily challenges should help me. Killing? No. Fishing? Not ready yet. Fishing series? Might be fine. Killing again? No. Killing? No. Killing again? Oh, this one is friendly. So as you can see, at least 3 out of 7 daily challenges can be completed it without killing anyone. Let's begin with traveling. Okay, it's not as easy as I thought because crazy squirrels and rabbits are literally trying to get killed by my horse. But here we go, easy gold and experience. And now let's go to featured series. I mean, from my experience, most players don't even kill anyone there. So I'm just running around, not killing anyone at all. And you know what? I'm an MVP and on the first place in my team because I played the game the right way. But who knows, maybe it was a mistake. So playing again, again just running around, ignoring everyone and everything. And not only my team won this time, but also again first place an MVP. Rockstar definitely shows us how this game should be played. I could have grind these PvP showdowns, but it would be just too easy. So let's try some different activities, for example Telegram missions. It was the last content Rockstar added to Red Dead Online, so I guess most of them can be completed in a peaceful way. In a first mission we will have to rob a mansion, so a stealthy mode, and we will be knocking out enemies, not killing them. Actually, I hope it's not counts as a kill, but we will check later. So pam pam, boom boom, and yeah, sorry, I don't have money for audio effects, so making them myself. Anyway, checking how many kills do I have now, and it's still zero. Great. Now looting everything and running away. But you know what? Since in Red Dead Online your payment is based on the time you've spent in a mission, I will pick myself berries, I will pick bulrush, and also Indian tobacco and other herbs. Actually, it will surprise you, but by picking flowers, you can make a lot of gold, as you will see later. But anyway, delivering mission and receiving a nice payout. Okay, so here is my plan. I will grind missions that can be completed without killing and also will focus on this specific award. It's the easiest award for beginners 
that you can reset because all you need to do is sell 100 herbs to doctor. And then here we go, resetting this award and receiving 0.4 gold bars, which is a lot for beginners actually. But I'm not gonna be grinding the same mission again and again, so let's try something different, a one horse deal. I completed this mission many times on my main character, but never even buzzed about stealth, was just killing everyone. I'm not even sure if it can be completed without killing anyone, but let's try. So here we go, knocking out the first guard, but unfortunately horse is not here. So carefully sneaking to the second possible location. Luckily NPCs are completely blind and deaf. Uh oh, this one actually hurt me, I hope it's not a kill. Anyway, let's try to break this horse, because we all know that NPCs cannot really shoot in Red Dead Online. I should have bought a tonic or something, anyway horse is broken, but I'm getting shot. But it's much more important to check if I still have zero kills, yes. So horse just run away in a field and now it's kinda easy. Simply riding to the destination point and just ignoring NPCs who are chasing me. But the problem is, I can safely collect flowers only in some small area around the destination point, because when I go too far, enemies appear out of nowhere and attacking me, but when I go back, they start ignoring me. Anyway, I collected all the flowers in the area and now let's complete the mission. Level 8, which is nice, and even have some money and gold already. I replayed this mission on harder difficulty to see if it can be completed in stealth and yes it can. And actually this time no one is chasing me, so I can go whatever I want and I can pick myself raspberries. Sorry, I tried to sing this, but raspberries is just there is no rhythm. Selling herbs and resetting a ward again, so more easy gold. I want to try as many different missions as possible, so let's try a tough business telegram mission, good and dead. I know for sure that it could and actually should be completed in stealth, but when I came to location, game actually told me to find and eliminate the target, which I suppose means kill. Okay, this one looks like the target, so getting close and ha! <laughs> Apparently it was the wrong dude, but who cares, he's not dead. After 5 minutes of running around, I finally found the target, and sneaking, sneaking, bam! Oh, actually, you know what, it counts, you can just knock him out and loot. No one is chasing me, so again, flower picking and delivering, so another mission completed with no kills. Since I reached level 10, now I have another way of making golden money with Without shooting at all, I'm talking about treasure maps. And here we go, another 1.6 gold bars. I tried other telegram missions, but was failing and dying, except for these telegram missions, which are just copy of rich picking and one horse deal, but in a different locations. Rich pickings is a super easy mission, just like an original one. And again, I even had an opportunity to collect flowers safely. But one horse deal on McFarland's ranch is a different story. It's much more interesting than an original one horse deal, obviously if you're trying to complete it in stealth. And it looks like this, bam, boom, bdish. Waiting, 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 boom, bam, breaking horse. And from here it's easy, uh, okay. Oh, nice mushroom. Anyway, after this one, I actually ran out of telegram missions that can be completed without killing, so I decided to pay a visit to Guido Martelli and his blood money. Let's see which of these missions can be completed without shooting. First of all, clearing house. Definitely sounds like something that you can complete in stealth. Now, this one is definitely the worst mission ever. Valuables are just lying in the house and no one is guarding them, so I just get in the house, picked up valuables and just run away. The only problem is that I have to be extremely careful while riding, because all these rabbits and squirrels are just running around trying to die. Actually, it's not the only blood money mission that can be completed in a boring way, with no shooting at all. For example, dog side contract part 1. So I'm just chasing a bandit, catching him, looting, then a little bit hiding from police, right here, they definitely can see me, and that's it, gathering flowers, just like I love to. 
too. And there are more such missions. Actually, in Dirty Money, Dirty Deeds, I had a problem because apparently you cannot knock out a person who is sitting on a chair. And also this dude kind of fell off a cliff after I knocked him out, but I immediately checked and no, I still have zero kills. Anyway, I had to use a sophisticated strategy called hit and run. Next, for hours I've spent like this. But unfortunately it was the last reward for selling flowers that I can reset. So I have to grind gold in some other way. First of all, finally getting a reward for picking up 1000 herbs. Next we have another easy award, jumping from horse on a moving train. 100 times, but it can be done in like 15 minutes. And after completing one more stranger mission, where I had to hit and run actually, because these missions unlike blood, money or telegram are not designed in a way to be completed without shooting. But anyway, after completing this one, I finally have 15 gold bars and you know what it means? It means that from now on I can earn as much money and experience as I want to without shooting at all, because I can buy a collector role. That's what I did, collected few sets in less than an hour and earned another $1000. Yes, so a double payout back then. But anyway, take a look, level 20, $2000, collector role and zero kills. But to be honest, you can earn gold much faster if you will be shooting, you know, in a traditional way. And if you want to find out details, I suggest you to go and watch my guide on how to earn gold in Red Dead Online. You can see it on your screen now. With that being said, stay safe, stay healthy, goodbye.